Hey guys, welcome to another episode of Witches of the Moon. I am your, well, I am supposed to be your Thursday's host, but I've been sucking at it lately. Um, I'm sorry. Okay, I had internet problems, but, but internet's fixed now. Everything's good to go, so I shouldn't have no more problems. Fingers crossed. Uh, but yeah, I am Thursday's host. <laughs> my name is Dia, aka Ori's Oasis of OriOasis.com, and this is Pick Your Own Topic. So I figured for this video, I'm going to briefly talk about vinegar, and I do mean briefly. And the reason why I talk, want to talk about vinegar is because everybody knows you know you use vinegar for souring, but vinegar is also um, a preservative, like you put, and it's also a cleaning agent. Well, certain vinegars are a cleaning agent. So, with it being a preservative, you can also use it or add it to things to preserve something. So, like anything acid is also, um, it's sour, but it's also preservative too. Like, you can use lemon juice in certain things, you can also use vinegar in certain things. With that being said, uh, where was I going? Because I started thinking about tomatoes and tomato sauce. <laughs> and how, you know, tomatoes is a preservative in itself. But, uh, let me let me bring it back. I think I'm hungry. <laughs> okay, so vinegars. Um, how do I explain it? So let's start with, um, there's different types of vinegar, right? So I'll start with um, coconut vinegar. Now, coconut coconut is normally used for like, in the in, in spell work. It's like in, integrity and chastity and, uh, I well, I like to use it for integrity, to keep the integrity and stuff, and for chastity and to an extent for cleansing. And you can also kind of use for blessing. So, what would you, how would you use the coconut vinegar? Well, you would add it to something. Um, you would add, use it as like to keep the integrity of something. Like if you have a relationship and you want to keep that integrity of relationship intact, you can make a vinegar jar for that. And mind you, the intent has to be to keep the integrity. And the other things you put in the jar has to match that of which keeping the integrity, not to sour them up. That's how you make the distinction between the two. Um... Or like you can use it, you can use it to, uh, to bless like a mojo bag with the intent again to keep the integrity of it. Also, um, rice vinegar. Rice vinegar is great for prosperity. Um, so is balsamic vinegar actually. Well, right, but I want to stick to rice vinegar. You can use that to um, keep the longevity of your prosperity workings. Because you know, again, vinegar is um, that's the word I'm looking for. I said it. I just said it. And I can't remember the word right now. But anyway, you can use it to keep the the longevity of that type of work. Apple cider vinegar, sherry vinegar, champagne vinegar. Those are good for um, relationships and for um, house blessings and peace and calm and, and bringing fun and joy into your environment. Um, that's basically it. Because I don't, I don't want this video to be real, too long. Um try to keep it under five minutes so it can load without any issues even though I got my internet fix I don't want to test the limits of it <laughs> so I'm trying to keep this video down but basically that's it you know vinegar is one thing that we don't really talk about much and everybody knows about souring but you can also use it because it pres preserves ah the word came back thank you <laughs> thank you spirit uh, but it came it came um you can use preserve stuff so you can oh, when you look at it that way you can look at how it opens up a whole new world of how to work with vinegar and vinegar products and different types of vinegar because there are a lot of different types of vinegar. So I hope you got something out of it and I will see you next time. Peace. Oh, don't forget to comment on everybody's videos. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't subscribed and don't forget to watch everybody's video and, you know, thumb, 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 thumb things up. <laughs> Alright guys, see y'all later. Peace.